Hello, Carolyn Herfith here with The Biz Truth. Welcome back. Today I want to talk about your ideal client. I got a call last week from Deb, who lives in Illinois, and she had this a little bit of a problem. And she said, Carolyn, I live a couple of hours outside of Chicago, and I'm having, I don't mind driving to, into Chicago to do networking and prospecting, but how do I know where to go? How do I know how to find my ideal client? So we started talking about who her ideal client was. And what I saw is that she had this, re she was thought she was narrowed down, but she actually had a much bigger uh, description than she should have. So we spent some time skinning it down, crystallizing, clarifying, and getting super, super granular on who she can help. And we even got her down to an industry of people who she can help, women within that industry and a very specific type, type of woman. And all of a sudden, the light bulbs went on. Because by getting really, really granular, it opened up this enormous, enormous opportunity for her. Because now she knows exactly where to spend her time. She knows what associations to call on. She knows where she can go network with these people. She knows that as she builds her name in that industry, she's going to be viewed as the expert. She's going to be viewed as the go-to. So whenever you have some resistance to wanting to, to quote unquote, pigeonholing yourself by defining your client so granularly, I want you to think about Deb in Illinois. Deb, I want to thank you for calling. Thank you for letting me share your story. And I would love for any of you to post questions or comments on the forum that apply to this situation. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.